procrastinating so much today. It's already 4 p.m. I still haven't done almost anything. <laughs> Hello, welcome back to another... Why is my nose big? I don't know what's happening here. Anyway, hi, welcome back to another video. What am I going to do this week? So I have a con next week, but I actually started already to do some things after the last con. So a lot of things are done. I still need to bring some uh, socks and I'm actually doing some earrings this week, which I'm actually quite excited. I really miss like sitting down and do things with my hands. What I really, really want to do this week is to finally have um, a sale ready for my shop. I have loads of second products. Um, as you guys know, guys probably know by now, I do second sale, uh, sales from time to time, and I've been saving a lot of things that are not quite perfect, but they are still usable. I really wanted to do that. Finally, I've been meaning to do that since January. It was supposed to be like a beginning of the year sale, uh, just to clean some stock and all of that. But hopefully we can do that this week. Today I think we're going to do socks and earrings and then tomorrow we can start on that or maybe, I don't know, I, I'm, <laughs> I don't even know where to start. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. I hope you enjoyed the video, bye! Some mail arrived, I got socks. I ordered some bottles to try out for um, a video I'm going to do in a couple of weeks. So these are just going to be saved over here because I'm not going to use them now. And I got a package, so I thought I could open it with you. Got some new labels from Mumbin. They kindly sent this to me and I can't wait to use them. And these are going to be used for my February um, goodies. It's now March, but I sent the goodie boxes on the month after, in the middle of the month. And this is just right on theme with the cake design, so I'm going to be using them for them. Then we also have some round ones, and these are like glittery gold. They're like transparent with gold glitter and I really want to also make some stickers to close the bags that I give clients on conventions and markets and I think these ones will be perfect for that as well. Okay, this is the products that I want to do boxes with. So I have seconds tote bags, seconds mugs, notebooks, bookmarks. I also have a box of tote bags and prints. These are perfectly fine. I just want to sell them because I have so many um, that I've done for like wholesale and all that. And then I had to keep them. And I also have a lot of t-shirts and sweats of designs that I don't really do much now um, that I want to sell and t-shirts, I don't use the colors anymore, all of that that I want to get rid of. So those are going to go on sale as well. These ones I'm going to have to take individual photos. Yeah, sizes and designs and all of that, but yeah. Lots to do. many socks um, 
this took me a little bit, it took me the rest of the afternoon. I only had one second, which I'm really happy with it. So this goes on the pile. So this is what happened basically when I pressed them, they got like folded. Um, so these are going to the second pile, but these are all done for next week. Off to the pile they go. I'm already feeling super organized because I never had things done so much in advance for a con. Getting things ready immediately after I came back from another con, it's the way to go and it's a lot easier. So I think I'm going to start doing that and I have time to like order products and blanks and all of that. So really excited about that, but yeah, I guess tomorrow we'll do the earrings and take care of the boxes. I was waiting to see if the rain would stop, but it isn't, so let's go to the studio. Bye bye. It's so warm and cozy. You're the cutest baby.
Oh my god, what the hell? <laughs> okay, so I just ordered some stamps, uh, some wood for stamps and the thank you card says we love your work. What the hell? And now it says a little gift for you. This is amazing. Customer service for the win. So basically I want to start to make stamps and a while ago I already ordered some wood pieces to try out but now I kind of defined on the sizes that I want to do so I ordered some more so we have some things like this then smaller ones like this tinier ones like this so really excited about this and I already found another supplier other than um, Aliexpress for the stamp things but this is such a cute thing I'm definitely going to like keep ordering from them not expecting that package to have like um, that was sweet of them um but yeah it's a lot of days later since i last spoke to the camera i had a con in the meanwhile it was my first comic con in portugal it was in porto and it was for four days so long for me it was crazy like on thursday it was a ghost town I made like 20 euros the whole day. I'm glad I was with friends and not alone because otherwise I would be so bored. <laughs> um, but yeah, tables were a bit expensive. So, and since it was my first Comic Con in Portugal, I was sharing a table with a friend. Uh, Friday was a bit better, but still pretty slow. So only Saturday and Sunday was a lot busier. Um, but everyone was so so nice. I had a lot of you come to the table and say hi So thank you so so much if you like but yeah, it was so so tiring four days way too much for me actually I've been drawing the um, Goodies for this month in March as you have seen from previous footage the theme for this month is going to be um, cherry blossom and Yeah, if you still want to get the goodies um, I'm going to insert a picture here of all the goodies. Uh, I only finished them now, so it's already the end of the month, so you still, you only have a couple of days to join. But yeah, with two cons in a month, it got too crazy and I couldn't um, finish them earlier. I'm going to be packing the stickers for February because I actually did a washi tape, if you remember for, from previous video, um, but they still haven't arrived. They are taking a bit longer to be made by my manufacturer. Normally in like two and a half weeks, three weeks, they are done and I don't want my uh, goodie box members to wait so long. So I'm basically just going to cut the sticker sheets and I'm going to be sending out the goodie boxes with stickers and I really wanted to try to do stamps because the product that I want to do for March is stamps that's why I ordered the um, the wood thingies um, so yeah really excited about that and let's get to work cut some stickers and then try to do some stamps I, I already have the materials here for so long but I keep putting them off because I'm afraid Everything that is related to the laser uh, engraving things, I'm always afraid that it, it's going to go wrong. But yeah, let's try that out. Wish me luck. This is already on the second pass and I don't know if you can see 
it's like full of dust in there and I was a little afraid that the rubber wasn't the best one but apparently it's normal and I need like a thing to take off the rest of the dust and to clean it with alcohol as well it's done let's try to take it out without putting dust everywhere And here it is, the stamp! It needs a bit of cleaning and I still, I'm still going to engrave the same drawing in here. That's what I'm going to do now. I'm so sad that I don't have um, an ink pad in here, but I'll try to put some footage of it over here for you to see the result. How cute does it look? Okay, I'm going to engrave it here so we can see the final result. Okay, this was the first time of me engraving such a thick wood and I even thought that was not going to be possible but yeah it's a bit hard to central center this one because when I put it on the program it was like on a perspective um, but yeah next time it will be more centered but this is the result I'm super super happy with it it looks so cute I can wait to get home and try it out um, I'm still going to give it a clean with alcohol and all that Look how cute it looks. I'm so happy with it and I can't wait to print all of the goodies and see all the box come together. It's so pretty. did some tests and I just realized that I totally forgot to mirror this image so it looks like this the final result so I did this one which is with a um, one that it has like a degrade kind of thing then this one is with red ink and with black ink it looks so cute this one fits so nicely really happy with it yay It's now the next day, let me show you what I managed to do yesterday. So I was doing all of this while the stamps were cutting. So I did some packaging stickers. I have the wrapping paper already here, the A5 sticker sheets, the vinyl stickers, these are glossy, they look so nice. The thank you card with a letter from me on the back. This will be to put on the envelopes. I had a hard time like fitting in the heart inside the heart, but 
I didn't want to change the drawing too much so this is what I have but I would love to do like a little face on the heart and then print them and put these on the shipping labels I think these hearts are so cool they are so big and nice but yeah this is all the goodies for the February box I still need to be print the bulk postcard next Monday though. I actually got an email yesterday saying that the washi, ta washi tapes arrived in Portugal so I already took care of costumes and all of that so I'm going to get them between Monday and Tuesday so I guess I'm just going to send everything together on next week's video I'll just cut all the stamps and all of that print also the March goodies like the stickers, the wrapping paper, everything that I've printed for the February one. I'm not going to pack these ones today as I had planned um, and then we'll do that together next week. I'm going to end this video here. I'm already editing it and I just want to show you the few bits that I finished yesterday besides the stamp. Let me know what you think about the stamp and what stamps I should have on the shop stickers you would like to see, like the bee and characters and all of that. Um, what stamps you would like to see, I would love to chat with you about that. But yeah, don't forget to subscribe, like this video and all of those things. If you want to grab the March box, you can still do it until the of 31st of March next Sunday. Um, you can join my Patreon, my membership, and now I also have subscription boxes available again uh, and that way you can get the box just for one time if you don't want to get a subscription you can just get the box check that out I'm going to leave links in the description for all of that so yeah thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys on the next one bye bye